side here on BBC Radio Lincolnshire and, and Ted, there must be something about this competition and, and great goals. You scored one at, at Shrewsbury when you got your Lincoln career underway and another one tonight. Yeah, I do like this competition actually. I think that's two and two. It was important to come here and put in a good performance and uh, get some goals and just try and get through to the next round. So we're all happy that we've done that tonight. Good for you to get some more minutes under your belt. The manager talked about the original plan to have you off at half time, but you just wanted to, to stay on and get as many minutes as possible. Yeah, annoying really, because I got through all the pre season feeling really good. Then just for the start of the season, I just tweaked my groin a little bit. Um, but now they're just managing me. Hopefully, I'll be fine Saturday, go again. Yeah, obviously, no player wants to come off, but sometimes you have to do the right thing. And uh, nice for you again, you move back into that midfield three, and, and it feels like there's a real partnership forming, not just between the midfielders, but everybody in the team. You all know what you're trying to do. Yeah, well, we've done a lot of work in training. I think that's been showing the last couple of games. Obviously, we've got a good understanding now with me and Scully down this left. I really enjoy playing with him, and Max coming into the team. So, yeah, we're, we're building partnerships all over the pitch, which is nice. How nice it to get that first win of the season? It's been a great start, and obviously, Rob with the two draws, but just to get that, that first victory. Yeah, I suppose a bit of relief just to come here and just get a win. You need that winning mentality in the squad if you're going to have success. So we we'll just get a win today, push on, hopefully win again Saturday, and then we'll, we'll get going. Does it fill the squad with confidence when you come to a place like Doncaster tonight and get the result you didn't dominate like you did? Yeah, it, it definitely does because you can come here, you can not play well, and then that, you take that into Saturday because it's still in everyone's mind. So to come here and get the confidence, the win like we did, is really positive for us. The head coach has talked to us a lot about trying to get that potential out of you week in, week out. Are you excited to work with him and to have somebody that believes in you like that? Yeah, well, unfortunately, because I've worked with him before in my uh, in my youth days at Ipswich, so we know each other. We I know what he wants and he knows what I want. So, yeah, hopefully we can have a really good season. Um, the manager or the head coach didn't really want to say who wants in the next round. Who would you like? Is there anybody you've got your eye on? Uh, I just want to get Tottenham at some stage, so win the next one, then get Tottenham <laughs> in the third round, be nice. There we go, so an easy win next round and then Tottenham third round. Exactly, yeah. At That's their place? Right. Yeah, it'd be nice. That'd be nice. Real nice. Yeah. Well done tonight, mate. Thank you, That's cheers. Yep. Uh, so, over a thousand Lincoln fans here tonight, how important is that for you to oh, support behind you? Honestly, unbelievable. We, we heard them all game, they almost got, got us the three points really, the way they turned out. and could have been easy to get not many fans here tonight, so yeah, credit to them, they're brilliant.